Hey, you're considering Squarespace for your small business website. That could be a great choice, but there are definitely some things you need to know about the pros and cons of the system to make sure you're choosing the right one for your business. Because the last thing you want to do is put all these hours and time and money into a platform that doesn't turn out to be the best. So I'm going to give you a brief overview of the system for a local business, see what makes sense and cover the pros and cons for you. So let's jump right into this. Okay, Squarespace is really easy to use. It's got a drag and drop editor and it's got beautiful pre-designed templates. Even those with no coding experience can build a professional looking website if you're willing to put the time in. Now, this is a major benefit for small businesses that might not have the budget for a web developer, but again, you're gonna trade your time and there's gonna be a learning curve to do it all. Now, it does have great mobile responsive templates. So Squarespace is going to ensure that your site looks great and functions smooth on all devices, desktops, tablets, smartphones. That's essential. Now, here's what I like about Squarespace. It's got a lot of built-in features to help with SEO and marketing your business. This includes tools to optimize your website content, integrate email marketing, manage social media campaigns, all in one platform. Squarespace also has scheduling. So it costs extra, but it allows clients to book appointments directly through your website. So this can be a huge time saver, but again, you're going to pay more for that. And it's a super secure platform. It takes care of web hosting, security updates, and ensure your website is always up and running. This gives you a lot of peace of mind as a business owner. Now, before we jump into the cons, if you're already thinking, I just want something simple and professional and cheaper, click on the link below to Mighty Sites for only $9 a month. A simple way to have a professional, easy website for your local business. So what are the cons of Squarespace if you're still thinking that direction? Well, it's got some limited design flexibility once you really start getting into it without having a little bit extra help. So the level of customization can get a little bit cumbersome and difficult to figure out when you're not really experienced in building websites. Now, it's also not necessarily ideal for super complex functionality, like maybe a Webflow or WordPress gives you a kind of limitless developer level flexibility. Squarespace is geared towards simpler websites. So if you really want to get into high e-commerce functionality, things like that, it might not be suitable long-term. Now, here's the other thing. There are going to be a lot of add-on costs. So like appointment scheduling, advanced e-commerce tools, all of that comes with additional monthly fees and you have to hit pick a higher price plan. So although it starts low, just be aware of what you're ultimately going to end up playing. And then think about your third-party integrations. Squarespace is a closed ecosystem, meaning you're limited to the integrations that they offer. This might be a drop back if you already rely on specific third-party tools for your business. Now, Squarespace is a strong website builder and it can help for a local business. It does have pretty easy drag and drop, beautiful templates, built-in marketing tools, comes at a higher cost and you will have to put your time into it. So just consider your specific needs and budget when you're making that decision. If you like this video, hit the subscribe and like and stay tuned because we're going to be sharing ways to create visibility for your local business. Thanks so much for joining me. We'll catch you in the next video.